Glacier Country Helicopters Project is a locally owned and run family business in Franz Josef. Gus and Poppy, a husband and wife combination, founded the firm in January 2014. They still have their sleeves rolled up every day doing their positions in the business and are both accomplished pilots. Them have a small fleet of incredible helicopters, including AS350B2 Squirrels and an MD520N. All airplanes are kept in excellent condition. They employ cutting-edge technology, such as outfitting all of their aircraft with V2 track systems that use satellite monitoring to keep ground staff in constant touch with pilots. Their highly competent pilot crew has vast expertise flying in the specific alpine environment in which they operate. All pilots receive rigorous training on a regular basis. Their firm and pilots have all had excellent safety records. They have a Qualmark Silver rating and are Civil Aviation Authority accredited, so you know you'll be in excellent hands when flying with our team. If you are a part of their adventure, you will have some unique chances. Fishing and heli hunting. Dinner and stretch hummer bundle. Glacier flights with scenic snow landings. Charters for individuals. Photo sessions and including any additional. It costs about 300 New Zealand dollars for a journey of about 75 minutes. During this journey you can land in about 10 minutes. Here you can walk to one glacier. It costs about $500 for a destination of about one and a half hours. About three glaciers can travel here. Similarly, for a destination of about 105 minutes, about $700 will be charged. About four glaciers can travel here. This way, as the prices increase, so do the experiences you get to experience on the trip. Also, their various packages have been introduced to you. The prices and details of these packages may vary according to the dates of your travel, so please use the data in the description below to know the exact prices. In general, you should pay attention to these points when traveling in these helicopters. A helicopter doesn't have a lot of space so don't carry bulky items. A backpack is highly recommended. We recommend you take a light jacket sunglasses and a hat as there is a lot of low temperature weather there. Carry only the essentials you need to take pictures, such as cameras. To reach this station, you have to travel 380 kilometers inland from Christchurch City. Then turn left at Kamara Junction and eventually reach this destination. You can also travel by train. You can reach this station by taking the train from Christchurch to Greymouth and then traveling to Franz Josef. If you are traveling from the North Island, you can reach your destination quickly if you fly to the South Island and travel the rest of the way to the station. So for today we will say goodbye. See you again in a new video. Always travel with safe. Be sure not to pollute any tourist spots. Let's protect our beautiful environment by disposing of garbage at the designated places.
Stay tuned to discover your travel destination with Tarupi. Follow us on social media now. Thank you.